Zach was playing the last couple of games, and do you have a sense that this was kind of just a matter of time? No, I just think it's law of averages. I mean, he's a great player, and you know, things started going. His battle level was up there, and uh, compete level. He's all in good situations. Last few games, and a uh, couple of, uh, well, the game in Chicago, I thought he should have got one or maybe two. Like I said, the one on uh, the power play was great traffic, uh, created a nice rebound, hit Darling's top of his uh, foot there on the wraparound, and then uh, the overtime one. So, like I said, we didn't need that game, but uh, he certainly. Uh, the whole team was happy for him tonight because uh, he had a big breakout game for us, and uh, we certainly needed it and put us all in a good driving position and being comfortable in the game. Day off help too, John. What's day, day off for Zach when, when he didn't have to, you know, took the maintenance that just, day. Just maintenance. How, uh, how? <laughs> but I said, did, did it help him, though? Oh, I'm sure, <laughs> sure it does, you know, give him time. And we talked about, you know, probably day off and with the kids. They got a new trampoline, he said, and that's what it's all about. <laughs> Thanks. Do you, you start getting days off now between games? I mean, uh, no, I just think that I, I think that our team should be uh, detailed enough, and uh, we give them film there uh, to prep for the game. I think that uh, we've got to keep our energy for our our pace, our speed, and playing fast, uh, and having shorter shifts to keep our game because we play a fast game and. Uh, we need that energy. Uh, you know, we can't be on the ice uh, spending 45 minutes talking about drills. We can talk about it through film, and we did a good job with a neutral zone. We spent time on that. We spent time on our uh, face-offs and uh, being a little more detailed on our exits. And uh, just we got we got to improve in a couple more areas. We got to talk better. We don't talk enough on the ice with our puck support, and that will lead to better puck possession. So that's a definitely identity with our team moving forward that we have to do a better job with. What do you think about the ruling that uh, Spurgeon's last goal was unassisted? I, you know, I, I don't get involved in that. <laughs> I, I really, you know, it, you know, it's, you know, you hope everyone gets credit for what they, what, what they, you know, did right. If it is, uh, you know, so. Uh, did you have you sensed uh, the frustration with Zach the last two three weeks? No, I mean, you know, great players want to do. Good things all the time, and uh, Zach's just gotta stick with his identity, which he's done a great job with. Uh, keep, you know, getting in front of that net. You know, like I said, uh, the first ten games of the year, I never seen, you know, seen, seen a guy work any harder, and uh, you know, I, I just see him battle, 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 and uh, those are the things that are coming now. I, I've seen it the last four or five games, and didn't get rewarded for it, but you know, it all equals out. If he got three or four points tonight, it equals out for the last four games, and then. Now we got uh, seven games left, and good things will happen for him. Just just keep working and, and st stick to his identity, and uh, good things will come. Did you consciously uh, tell the team not to look ahead to the Colorado game? As you mentioned, oh, we're not time. worried about. Uh, we, now we look forward. This game's over. Did a great job. I, I said focus. You know, this might come down to the last period of the last game of the year. So that, that's what we're focused on, uh, but we're game by game. We're not worrying about uh, who our next opponent was uh, when we get a game in front of us. Calgary's a hell of a team. They got uh, three defensemen and Goudreau and Monaghan that uh, they're lighting it up. And uh, when you have three defensemen with 40, 40 plus points, you're really worried about. They're in 200 plus goals for. So, uh, you know, and their power play's been clicking. Uh, they've been uh, at 20, 24%, I think, and their PK was at uh, 91%. So those are all tangibles we got to focus on. And uh, I, haven't, I haven't even thought about the Colorado game until tomorrow morning.